Tehran. What can I say? It was, um, it was, it was, it was clearly our fault. I'm speaking on behalf of Rose's Chocolates, and uh, I'm sorry that we confused and upset you with our ridiculous packaging. Um, what can I say? You know, it's it's fairly boring churning out chocolates every year, and uh, particularly for the Christmas market, and and you get overexcited about things, and sometimes you think you know you should innovate and improve things when in fact they didn't need improving in the first place. So we, we've done away with the nice way you just unwrap them by tw twisting them, and, and out they come, and um, no. you know you've got to fiddle around with the wrappers with you with you with your uh, with your fingernails. Um, I, I, I take personal responsibility, and I, I must admit that we at Rose's Chocolates we're we're we're, we're a bunch of idiots, and um, we offer our sincerest and deepest deepest apologies, and um, we, we'll we'll try not to do it again. I, I I don't know what we were thinking, and and you you were quite right to point it out, and we take full responsibility. You're in no way to blame. Don't blame yourself. Um, and. Um, uh, if I had any money, I'd send you some some chocolates from last year. But um, but uh, this is a free sample apology, so I apologise for that. That second apology cost twenty five quid, by the way. Uh, I won't go any further with the apologies, but I can only say that we are deeply, deeply, deeply sorry. Sorry. <laughs>